हेलो डी एस स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू ई सी ई अकेडमी बेनिफेक्टर द टॉपिक ऑफ द क्लास इज एप्लीकेशन ऑफ मल्टी रेट सिस्टम इन विच विल बी डूइंग डिजिटल फिल्टर बैन इट्स एप्लीकेशन वी कैन से इन सब बैंड कोडिंग इन द लास्ट क्लास वी हैव सीन अबाउट एनालिसिस फिल्टर बैंक एंड सिंथिस फिल्टर बैंक एंड हाउ डू वी यूज दैम इन अवर सब बैंड कोडिंग फॉर प्रोसेसिंग ऑफ स्पीच सिग्नल विल बी सेंग टूडे इन दिस क्लास लेट स्टार्ट द क्लास सो जस्ट गिविंग ए क्विक रिव्यू ऑफ द डिजिटल फिल्टर बैंक फिल्टर बैंक्स आर ऑफ टू टाइप्स एनालिसिस फिल्टर बैंक एंड सिंथिस फिल्टर बैंक एंड यू नो वॉट इज एनालिसिस फिल्टर बैंक डूइंग इट इज़ कन्वर्टिंग एन इनपुट सिग्नल इन टू नंबर ऑफ सब बैंड सिग्नल्स वैन पासिंग थ्रू डिफरेंट सेट ऑफ बैंड पास फिल्टर्स ओके सो वेल इट इज़ यूज दिस एनालिसिस फिल्टर बैंक वैन यूज इन सब बैंड कोडिंग वी आर यूजिंग डाउन सैम्पलर एट द ट्रांसमीटर सेक्शन ओके सो हियर दिस दीज आर फिल्टर्स ऑफ ट्रांसफर फंक्शन एच नॉट ऑफ जेड एच वन ऑफ जेड एच टू ऑफ जेड एच एम ऑफ एम माइनस टू ऑफ जेड एच ऑफ एम माइनस वन ऑफ जेड एंड सो ऑन एन दे देन आफ्टर द आउटपुट ऑफ ईच फिल्टर इज डाउन सैम्पल्ड बाई ए फैक्टर ऑफ एम टू गेट द आउटपुट सिग्नल यू नॉट ऑफ जेड यू वन ऑफ जेड एंड सिमिलरली यू कैन गेट आउटपुट सिग्नल यू ऑफ एम माइनस वन ऑफ जेड सो हियर एक्स ऑफ जेड द इनपुट सिग्नल इज पास थ्रू द एनालिसिस फिल्टर बैंक एंड देन डाउन सैम्पल्ड ओके सो here one point is this h not of z is a low pass filter the filter h not of z is a low pass filter h1 of z till h of m minus 1 h of h1 of z to h of m minus 2 of z are band pass filters and h of m minus 1 of z is an high pass filter so this filter bank is comprising of low pass filter band of band pass filters and high pass filter the filter bank this is known as filter bank the filter bank splits the signal splits the input signal into number of sub bands each having a band bandwidth of pi by m each having a bandwidth of pi by m so that there will be no overlapping of the signals okay so it's an m channel as there uh, it is divided into m channels it is an m channel analysis filter consists of m sub band filters known as analysis filters as a spectrum of the signal is band limited to pi by m the sampling rate can be reduced by a factor of m the down sampling moves all the sub band signals into a base band of ranging from 0 less than equal to omega less than equal to pi by m so after passing through this uh, analysis filter they are down sampled because each sub band signal is having a bandwidth of pi by m so after down sampling the um, the signals the sub band signals into base band of ranging between 0 to pi by m in synthesis filter bank here the synthesis filter bank will have different input signals which are combined into one this is synthesis filter before synthesis filter its up sampling is done at the receiver side so at the transmitter side we are having down sampling and at the receiver side up sampling with along with the synthesis filter the synthesis filter bank is used to reconstruct the signal x cap of an approximate the original signal so now let us see the n m channel sub band coding filter bank this is the diagram of a m channel sub band coding filter bank this is a filter bank and this filter bank is used for sub band coding where do we find its application in 
in speech signal processing. So, it is having two parts, this is one part and this is the other one, this is the transmitter section and this is the receiver section we can understand. So, here these are uh, band pass um, analysis filter, input x of z is given, analysis filter down sampled by factor m and at the receiver side they are up sampled by factor m and then passed through the synthesis filter bank to get one composite signal or one output signal. Okay. So, this is how the signal is processed in a multi rate system, multi rate system first it is down sampled and then up sampled and then passed through the synthesis filter bank. So, we can have two important points here, the, um, the M channel sub band coding filter bank is a combination of synthesis filter and analysis filter. So, here analysis filter and synthesis filter, speech signal we can find its application in speech signal. I hope uh, this diagram is clear, uh, we have to cover the next two points about sub band coding of speech signal. In the transmission side the input signal is split into m number of overlapping frequency bands using analysis filter, analysis filter bank consisting of m number of band pass filters. The output of each band pass filter is decimated by a factor of d. On the receiver side, the received sub band signals are interpolated that is up sampled to recover the missing samples. The output of the interpolators are applied to a synthesis filter bank consisting of m number of band pass filters to recover the original signal. Okay. So, in the sub band coding is used for speech signal processing and it is one of the application of multi rate DSP system. At the transmitter side we are having analysis filter bank along with the down sampler decimator and then at the receiver side we are having interpolators and synthesis filter bank. I hope you have understood the class. If you have any queries you can post in the comment section.